Somaliland is considered one of the most climate-affected African countries of the Horn due to over 29 years of deforestation and land degradation from human activities. The increased use of biomass or biofuels as domestic sources of energy such as wood and charcoal in the country adversely affect the environment. Analysts say only less than 10% of the country has trees and vegetation which expresses a very critical statistics. According to a 2007 study by the Academy for Peace and Development, more than 2.5 million trees are felled annually and burned for charcoal in Somaliland. The report stressed that each household in Somaliland consumed an equivalent of 10 trees a month. The charcoal is just is widely used in this country. Mainly, it, it is not uh, the, in, in, in the rock one, it's uh, the one who comes from plants. People use it in, indoors, and you know, it can uh, create and, and produce a lot of uh, carbon monoxide. And if it is not, if it is not uh, well and uh, burnt, it produces fumes, which can cause uh, lung problems, and at the end, in, in pulmonary lung diseases, COPD, chronic obstructive lung disease, bronchitis, that sort of thing which is basically an, um, a lung disease. Somaliland Ministry of Environment and Rural Development confirms that charcoal production accelerates the process of desertification, decreasing the amount of land usable for agriculture or grazing and pushing locals out of areas as they become uninhabitable after charcoal producers clear all the trees. <laughs> Yes, charcoal is an environmental disaster. Of course, it's a very big disaster, which is getting worse day after day, and the effect on us is unimaginable and that cannot be counted. We all have a right to live with a clean environment, and Allah blessed us with a beautiful environment that we benefit from. The environmentalists worried that the trade in charcoal may wipe out some tree species and in turn affect the GDP of the country as livestock, which is the backbone of Somaliland's economy, rely on them. For the last uh, five decades, things have got, gone worse uh, actually. And uh, this is uh, due to a number of issues. Uh, of course, uh, deforestation is the biggest problem we have. Uh, uh, overgrazing, uh, you know, land degradation, uh, recurrent drought is all these contribute, you know, to land degradation. But coming to uh, charcoal production, of course, this is the main source, and it has been uh, for long the main so source of biomass bio energy for the Somali people and uh, it's only I mean nowadays that we are seeing and uh, the recent years that uh, we are seeing you know I mean alternatives coming and uh, you know I mean uh, a lot of trees particularly you know those species which are very very useful uh, to uh, uh, to the communities particularly the pastoral uh, communities has been targeted because for example uh, just to cite one example, is the Acacia Pusai, uh, that's, uh, we call it Galol in Somali. Uh, it's believed, you know, to be uh, uh, producing, you know, the, the best charcoal. Uh, so, uh, of course, it has declined dramatically. I mean, uh, rangelands have been uh, uh, totally uh, uh, deforested. And, uh, and of course, uh, yes, uh, uh, it's not only the charcoal, but also the firewood. Yeah, there are quite, I mean, and, and many businesses using uh, firewood. For example, the bakeries and, you know, the stuff and so on. So, so uh, yeah, it's affecting the environment. It's affecting the biodiversity. In any area where, uh, uh, you know, charcoal production is going on, it's not the trees that are suffering, but also, you know, the the, the shrubs layers and the hair layers and and imagine also you know the uh, uh, the, the the fauna you know the, the 
the, the, the animals, you know, the, the, uh, uh, the wildlife, uh, that, that, that causes habitat loss. And if the habitat is lost and become degraded, uh, you know, the, uh, those uh, uh, living things, whether they are, I mean, animals or plants, they die. To tackle this environmental menace, which bears long-term impacts on the economy of the country, however, some gas distribution company began supplying people with finest gas since 2009 as an alternative option for energy which drastically reduced the rise in demand for charcoal in Somaliland. As a first environmental friendly company whose primary mission is to supply liquefied petroleum gas LPG for powering essential life needs such as cooking, industrial and health facilities, some gas leaves no stone unturned in sensitizing the general public about the dangers of desertification. Abdurrahman Abdullah Yusuf is the general manager of some gas. He speaks on the core values of the company with a mission to deliver affordable, safe and reliable quality of LPG to protect the environment and enrich communities. Some gas it's a first environmental friendly company whose primary mission is to supply LBT for the power essential life needs such as, such as cooking, industrial and health facilities. Our vision to be the leader in providing LBT gas distribution solution in the whole of Africa. So we deliver affordable LBT, safe, reliable and happiness quality of the gas and to protect the environment and enrich our community. Our product is a different cages, beginning 2 kg, 4 kg, 6 kg cylinders, 11 kg cylinders, 22 cylinders and 44 cylinders. And commercial uh, cylinders that the restaurant is used for the cooking. Abdurrahman maintains that some gas primarily supplies LPG, which consists of simple hydrocarbons, mainly propane and butane, which is among the few clean and efficient burning fuels known to mankind. A highlight plans on national expansion and distributions for regions such as Somaliland, Portland and Ethiopia. Living up to the mandate of being the leading distribution in the Horn of Africa, some gas ensures an articulate chain of distribution from Berbera gas terminal points to other distribution points such as Hargeza terminal, Bor Borama and Sheikh without compromising the standards in terms of quality and professionalism. The main reason of this establishment is to make an environment safe, a beautiful and and a, a place which attracting the other people to live to us and to make a, to increase the employment of youth and in our country. One of our uh, pillars that we stand is to fight against the use in the charcoal and to uh, and to make awareness to our population to use a, a, a LBG gas, cooking gas, which is more safer and health and clean and cheap also because the one package of charcoal it may be one, 150,000 Somali shilling instead of when an 11 kg of gas will be avoided one, 145 something like that so it will become more cheaper in the future we hope that when the price of gas will be cheaper in the future and in the future and also now when we are comparing this current time to the previous time now, our population are getting more involved in using gas and L for L LPG gas. All some gas services and delivery men are properly trained to efficiently and timely meet the target demands of customers on a daily basis, keeping to the core values of the company, which dwells on profitability and safety. Hanka 
اللهم صل على محمد وحنك بلاوني وهرجيسة إلا إيو مجال هذا هرجيسة إذا هالت هذا لبيه تمرق كبحة اللهم صل على محمد هذا نافر تاكو صون قضاء قام كأنه شقينا وحكم هذا وجه ريا إن الجوار إنه يمدان we have in and out in this compound, and we always receive more cars here. We store empty gas tanks in here, and the full tanks on the other side. We fill the gas tank and check their weight. If we see an unclean tank, we put it aside and start cleaning it. We also repair the damaged ones. Once the demand increases, our productivity also increases. We are always ready to produce much as our demand increases because we have standard equipment. <laughs> Each sales outlet, which spreads across all Somaliland regions and beyond, maintains the same quality of the products and services, as prices of products are uniform everywhere and relatively cheap. Marwa is a sales manager of the Jigjigir outlets. This cylinder is much expensive from this one. This cylinder is at 45 and the gas 17. So okay. it's gonna be t uh, 62. 62. And this 35 for the cylinder, mm -hmm. 17 for the gas. It's gonna be 52. Wow. So they have ten dollar no, difference. difference. Yes. Now I, I see this one. Mm -hmm. It's it's uh, smaller and then um, yeah. Yeah. See? You can. Okay. Mm -hmm. So how much is this one? And then what's the size? Uh, it is six kg. Okay. And. Well, I could see. Eight. You don't need stuff for this one. Okay. You can directly use it like this. Mm. Mm -hmm. So easy? Easy. So wow. easy. Nice. So Excellent. Easy. So how much is this one? The full set is $40. $14. $14. $14. No, $40. Dollar. Okay. And the gas will going to be, when you reveal it, $10. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wow. This is very nice now this is what i'm talking about the prices of the products from the high i mean the biggest one which is like around 25 uh, kg to uh, 14 kg or 14.1 kg are the same everywhere whether you are buying it from the souk or you are going to uh, sanag region anywhere across somaliland the prices are consistent no cheating and no hidden agenda? Uh, actually, we give uh, more training, uh, free installation is maintained, and, and after series surface, uh, we train them, uh, whether they are restaurant or household, we train them, we tell them about the uh, risks and benefits. Farhan Abdi Jama, the Somgas Human Resource Manager takes us through Hargeza filling site and the process of keeping to the industry standard and ethics. This is our filling site, Hargeza. Now here, this is the, the, the production place. In here, we make ceiling for a protection that the falf will not move. And also that customers are happy to know that this is the full of. And it, it, uh, it classifies or it differentiates the full one and the empty one. It's very important. This uh, place are filling. There is three uh, filling operators and, and this is the filling, uh, you know. Uh, so uh, we can see uh, one, uh, one cylinder you are filling off. He said a socially responsible company, Sumgas is poised with a mission to salvage environment by sensitizing general public to use Sumgas products instead of felling valuable trees. With its digital filling station, Sumgas is capable of charging 2,000 cylinders in an 8-hour shift according to set standard of 11 kg cylinders, 
This system can also be utilized for charging a range of cylinders in 2, 4, 11 and 22 kg cylinders based on latest acceptable international standards. As part of its scorecards to efficiently provide gas to all and sundry in the country, SunGas collaborates with Dahui Transport Service for its delivery ecosystem, therefore making it easy to supply gas to homes, offices and restaurants as fast as possible. As the way company, we are we have greatly boosted some gas sales and customer connections. To our simplicity of ordering the gas, or to the simplicity of the ordering of the product from the way, and with the ease of delivering it, so you can, and that enables customer so that we can retain the customer and also make some gas happy. One more thing, since the immense data that we have and all we have gathered through our systems, we are able to track and follow up with those customers who for a long time didn't buy or stop using some gas products when they used to buy through the way. So immediately, the moment we realize that, we prepare our, or we dispatch a team to go and get them back, to retain them, because we have that latter. So is that is the main reason that we help, and that it, uh, some guys actually as its customer relation. We are the best performing service company in the wider Somali region and Somaliland. What we are able to do is that we have a 24-7 open call center and immediately at the call center when they receive the order our clients make the order they go ahead and process the order and call back the client to confirm the point of delivery after that they pass on that information to the carrier call who are our ready, our carriers are ready, stand by on to deliver that product. In a move to build customer relation, SomGas inscribes hotlines on all their cylinders to reach their customer care office for any delivery service or emergencies. It is therefore not a surprise that SomGas products received a wider acceptance among many users from home front, small eateries and large-scale restaurants in rural and urban settlements. Mohammed Iskandar is a home-based baker who prefers some gas to any other means of fire sources. He says some gas offers customer-friendly package, approachable and cheaper than other sources of energy. If I start in, in charcoal, I have a difficult because I don't have an experience for charcoal, first things. Second things is for uh, time, short time. When you're using gas, you have it like a five minutes, two minutes. When you're cooking, you have a, your timer, how much you're using for cooking it, like a half an hour, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, like that. But in charcoal, you can't use it, you machine for time. Company, I use it from them, uh, some gas. Uh, people there is very, very, uh, very kind people. And you see like uh, friends, like uh, brothers from them, yourself. And every time when you take in from them uh, gas, you don't see in somebody like uh, uh, customers, they using like a uh, uh, friends from your side. We know each other. Or sometimes maybe I get from them credit, uh, some of gas. Uh, I have uh, extra gas uh, from my side, uh, bottles uh, inside. Uh, two piece from using it from my bakery and the other one for my house. And we have three extra for changing. Anytime is uh, one of the gas is finished from my side of my house side. 
I have the change for the other one to change it. And after that, next day, I go to the, uh, the company for the gas, some gas. And I have a good friends there. Uh, they give me for two, three bottles. I'm using it for next days or next month. Saeed Muhammad Ali is a professional chef of many years of experience and the owner of fish and steakhouse restaurants. He says some gas has helped his business in terms of speed and profitability. I will advise all people to use it, even restaurants, the house, the houses, all the people. I advise them to use because it's it's good for health. It's good for everything. Before we, we were using charcoal. You cannot produce more 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 things. You cannot satisfy your client. But now I can do a lot of things. I can work for a lot of people anytime. There is a lot of difference between before. We, we couldn't make m much money, even br uh, profit. Now you can make a lot of profit. Sheikh Faisal Ali is a chef at Riverside Hotel who believes Somgas is a life-saving company for many restaurants and home, comparing it with other products in Somaliland. I cannot put it in a, in a, in a same basket, the gas and the charcoal. I would say the charcoal to use in different terms of food. I love charcoal, the food that cooked with the charcoal because it's got a good flavor and the aromas and the smoke things. But effectiveness is not compatible. It's just like a day and night. It's completely like a day and night because when you use gas, the charcoal, you have to first fire up the, you know, the charcoal and you have to weigh, you have to blow it and, and you get all the smoke, you know, and that's all over the places. But the gas is not like that. You just go ahead. Connected to the uh, the gas cylinder to the to the host, and just just put it on the gas, and then put it on the the, the fire, and there you go, you have the flame, easy, just like yes. So I 100% rather to use have gas when it comes to the time, and 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 and, 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 and then you know the. The availability because sometimes you don't even have no charcoal here and the other thing for the charcoal because charcoal you know it comes from the trees and when it's used the, the charcoal you encourage the community to get the trees and also to fire them to make money and the end of the day it's going to be commercial and what's going to happen down the road a few years down the road maybe it's going to be deforestation or something Other notable cooks in Hargeisa City recommended some gas as the best cooking gas available in the market, which is safe and cheap at the same time. When it comes to safety, some gas leaves nothing to chance. Every sales outlet is equipped with first aid and fire extinguishers in case of fire outbreak. All terminals, including hottest Berbera, have an emergency pool where considerable volume of water is drawn from, as well as evacuation plans. Somga's commitment to safety also means expecting the unexpected. This is why Somga's don't just sell gas products to customers. It also trains them on how to set up for ease of use. Now, they've sold the gas to me. Every other thing has been fixed. They connected the, the pipe I mean, the hose to the gas and then to the plates, which, of course, I'm going to be using. Okay, can you uh, show me how to use it? Okay, so this is one of the services that some gas renders. They didn't just sell the product to you. Um, for the safety and ease of use, they also teach you how to use it. And this is one of the benefits that you get from Songas that other brands don't provide for you. Thank you very much. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. To explore extra miles on safety, Songas sought training from the Somaliland National Fire Brigades, which includes participation of all staff, especially those dealing directly with filling and delivering of liquefied gas. Saheed Mohammed Yaqub is the head of public training and awareness of the Somaliland Fire Brigade. 
He said the training became important for some guys to help them attune to their safety plans. This training uh, is very important for everyone, whether it's a home, uh, offices, uh, companies, and everywhere. Because it's a matter of safe living and properties. So um, companies, they should have trained their employees to use and know how to use the fire extinguishers to protect the building, to protect themselves and the environment. So uh, the fire brigade always seeking to you know, give knowledge to the people to protect themselves and their properties and as well as the environment. So this um, training, we just gave it to uh, some guys, uh, employees, and this is very important for them and for the community. Um, we just training them how to use the fire extinguishers, uh, how to deal with the, uh, uh, the LBG, that, that's some gas, you know, um, how to handle with it, how to carry, and how to transport, uh, and all those things. So it's very important for everyone to know how to build a fire when it is um, in a small stage. And this is a very good, you know, um, training for them. And they give a training to the community which they are serving for. A visit to Berbera, the capital of Sahel region of Somaliland, which plays host to the Sumgas largest storage in East Africa, gives so much to desire. Dubbed Sumgas Terminal Storage, the site houses a long queue of massive gas storages capable of supplying the entire Somaliland and all the horn of African nations. The multi-million dollars investment is always busy with storing of supplies, filling of trucks and distribution of loaded gas to other parts of the country. The terminal storage, no doubt, is fulfilling its potential to restore the lost glory of the environment as it has the capacity to supply the entire country with refined gas. Engineer Ahmed Abdullahi Ali is the operational manager of the Berbero Terminal Storage. He took us through the inner workings of the terminal, which involved technical fillings and fill-outs of the entire system. He envisions strategies for expansion, which according to him, is in line with the vision of Sungas to be the leader of gas distribution in East Africa. We supply the gas in Somaliland, uh, Butulan and part of Somalia. So in our future we want to uh, supply also the Toby also. But uh, tank is a 22 tank. Uh, so our capacity as I told you is the, uh, one of the largest terminal in East Africa. And also is our capacity 1000 plus in this time. But in our future, our one, in near future we want to increase again. The terminal consists of three interconnected sections, namely the 400 meter long storage facilities firmly coated with 50 to 80 diameter iron pipes that sit from top to ground. The pipeline plant controlling units where gas is filled in and gauged and the fill outside where trucks and cylinders are filled. At the control unit, there are varieties of preventive technology to cut off flow and leak with safety valves which controls air pressure. Worthy of note is the high temperature of Berbera, the hot zone with higher running weather from around 36 to 42 degrees Celsius Fahrenheit. This no doubt poses a serious threat to the gas in the storage, hence the need for cooling system. Some gas has carefully put in place showering system which evenly sprays the storage tanks with water on a daily basis. Safety is the, very, uh, the priority one for us and because uh, now the Berbera is hot so we use the safety valves, also the uh, switch offs for the emergency and also we use also the fire water uh, and also we use the CO2, the border also we use also 
So at the time of uh, the temperature high, uh, we also cooling down the, by using the showering by water. Each tank has uh, its own showering and also its own uh, firefighting also. So we are, uh, the, the firefight is our priority one for us. No doubt, every Songa's product is inspired by environmental restoration. The nationalistic desires to rescue the shattered and battered environment and to make life better. Songas is constantly evolving and innovatively expanding as the leading distribution gas company in East Africa to make sure that everyone gets involved in the fight against deforestation and land degradation by supplying the best of gas products to homes and businesses. Some gas products are not just carefully prepared for ease of use, they are also safe, user-friendly and relatively cheap. Next time you pick up some gas products, just know you have played your part in saving the environment from degradation.